What is up YouTube, it's your boy Breezy Kicks, the sneaker fiend. Now today we got the Nike Sakai Mid Blazers. Before we get into it though, make sure if you're new to the channel, you subscribe. Hit that like button if you like the content. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at Breezy underscore Kicks 23. It's your boy Breezy Kicks, let's get it. So, starting off with the box, you got this orange Nike box. It is a slider box, size eight and a half, Nike Blazer Mid Sakai. The reason I got these in an eight and a half and not a 10, which is my size, is strictly just for resale. Eight and a half were going for the most, so that's what I went for. And luckily, I was able to get a pair. So, these are going straight to StockX after this video. Bam! The Nike Sakai Mid Blazer. Now, if you guys don't know anything about this sneaker, Nike had a collaboration with Sakai. They came out with four different models, two of which were Nike Mid Blazers, coming in this colorway, as well as a white and blue colorway. Then they also had the LD Waffle that came in a green and orange colorway, and then like a red and blue colorway. These things are a lot nicer in person. Quality's on point. I'm loving the layered look. I was able to make some money on these, so it was good resale, but I kind of want a pair for myself. So as far as the colorway, I really like it. At first, I honestly didn't like this colorway as much, but in person, it looks so much nicer. I definitely dig the colorway. I think it's pretty dope. And I actually think if I was to cop for a personal pair, I'd probably go with this colorway where I originally thought the blue colorway was going to be better. Now let's talk about this whole design. What they did was they went with this layered look. They wanted everything to seem layered, layered midsole, layered logos, double laces, double tongue. Up in the toe section, you can see it is layered and it runs up here. So as far as the concept of the sneaker, I really like it. They absolutely killed it when it comes to the concept of giving it that layered appearance. Up in the toe section, you guys can see just how nice that leather is. It's really thin in the toe section, but as you come back here, it's a lot thicker, but it's really good quality. I'm not disappointed at all. One of my favorite parts is the Nike Sakai. I like how they kind of just layered the Nike on top of the Sakai. I think it looks really dope. It also is in the back of the tongue as well. Like I was saying, my favorite part is this layered tongue. I think that's just such a dope look. I was curious on how it was gonna come with it layered, like where's the stitching gonna be? So the tongue comes up about here and then that's where the other part of the tongue is stitched on. If you guys have any worries about that, you should be good. It's not gonna be uncomfortable or anything. One thing that I have to say I don't like about the shoe is the laces. I love the look. I just think it's gonna be a pain in the butt to have to lace these up. Every time you wear them, just the double lacing and it's, it's pretty bulky. Getting in and out of these shoes, it's just gonna take twice as long because you got twice the laces. You do have that like brown blazer mid outsole. The shoe's pretty light. I was kind of worried as far as the layering in the heel section and on the midsole, if this thing was gonna be heavy. Actually, it is still very light. If you guys ever mess with blazers, you know they're fairly light. They're not a heavy sneaker. And this right here really isn't adding for any extra weight. So retail, these cost $140. Uh, I was able to sell mine for $350. So I'm coming up top about $210. That's not counting shippings and fees, so uh, I'll probably lose 
about 30 in that whole process. So at least 175, somewhere around there that I made just in profit. And I've only had these in hand for an hour. It's good when you can get a hold of a shoe for retail and be able to flip it for some extra money. There you guys have it. Let me know what do you guys think of the sneaker? Did you cop? Are you going to cop now that you've seen this video? What do you think of the layered look, the Sakai Nike collab? Let me know all that good stuff down below. Again, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. Hit that like button if you like the content. Boy Breezy Kicks, we out.